Where is the peace? Where do we find a peace that lasts? People look everywhere to find this peace, and I think there's three huge needs that we have. Finding love, finding joy, and finding peace. So where is this everlasting peace beyond understanding? Well, it sure isn't out there in the external world, is it? It's not in our jobs, it's not in relationships, it's not in having a lot of money. It's not even in religion. It's not out there. Jesus gives us hints when he says, the kingdom of God is within you. So when we come into this new year and we fear or we think about or worry about losing our job or losing a meaningful relationship or having more money, it's not really those things that we want to experience, but something deeper underneath, and that is the experience of peace. The peace we think the job will give us, the peace that we think that relationship we have will give us, the peace we think we'll have when we have a lot of money in our bank account. We want that deeper experience of peace. So we make giant strides in our walk of faith when we realize and understand it's not out there and that's what we really want. And in the scriptures, Jesus says, peace I give to you, not as the world gives, but as I give it. Then we have this passage in Galatians about the fruit of the spirit. It says we're already filled with the fruit of the spirit, love, joy, and peace. You see, the peace we're looking for isn't out there. It's already within. It's already there. So the question is letting it come. And there's a hint that we get in Colossians 3, verse 12. Beautiful verse that says this, Let the peace of Christ dwell in your heart or rule in your heart. So there's the secret for this new year, huh? to let the peace of God be the umpire, I think the word is actually translated, to rule in our hearts, to let it come. So we become still, we become aware, and we let flow what's already there within. If we would just look there, be still, experience it, and even ask God directly, let me experience your peace. So just a short thought coming into this new year, what we desire most, what we're looking for most, that love, joy, and peace. It's already within by God, by his spirit, the kingdom of God within. Let it flow. Let it come. Surrender. Trust. Because you are loved. You remain as God created you. God's got you. God's got your back, God's got you, and everything is going to be okay. So until next time, may you live, may I live, all the days of our life.